Hey guys, it's Allison, and today I'm filming a saddle pad collection video. And this collection video is going to be pretty different than the last one that I filmed at the beginning of my channel starting. And so, um, if you love saddle pads, keep watching. Okay, so I will say that my collection is totally, totally crazy, and like, definitely don't need all these. But, um, yeah, there, there's an addiction here. Okay, so the first one is this one. It's a Ladia Cool Max. This one my trainer got me, and it's white with black trim, and it's got the logo. I haven't actually used this one yet because it's winter and the horses are really too dirty to be wearing a white pad. Okay, so next is one of the newer ones to me. I just bought this one used, so I haven't actually used it yet, but I did wash it. And so this is the Equestrian, oh, it's making a shine. <laughs> Equestrian Stockholm, and this one is full size. It's navy, hopefully it's showing up, I'm not sure. And it's navy with white trim and some nice binding. This one is newer to me also, but I needed this for my young horse because he's rapidly changing as with his body. And so this is the Lemieux Pro Lambskin six pocket shimmable half pad. I got this in large. It is kind of too big for my saddle, but that's all they had. So this is what I got. And so it does have shims. It comes with these like Prozorb foam shims. I am using them in the front because I really need a lot of lift in the front. And then I bought some wool stuff to put in the middle and then nothing in the back. And so I do like this one. It has like a spine free channel. It is one of my rapidly beginning to be my favorite types of saddle pads. And this one is the Lemieux Lower. I'm not sure why I'm saying that right. But this is the ice blue color. I got this one from Dover and I really, really like it. I've actually been using it really quite a lot. Next is one that I typically wouldn't really like just based on like the build and brand, but this is like a super soft saddle pad. And this is the Weatherbeta Air Tech. And this is navy and it's got some nice binding. I use this one a lot actually because it's super soft. So again, we've got another Lemieux Lower. This one is the navy and it's dressage cut, obviously. I really like how they have this reinforced billet area. So the next one is the new Back on Track Knights Collection dressage pad. I like this. This is quite similar to the Equestrian Stockholm. I like thickness. I really didn't like their old pads. They really sucked. Next is an Eco Gold Cool Fit dressage pad in brown. These are my absolute favorite, favorite saddle pads for summer. And so you can put shims and whatever they come with. I don't know their shims, but support in there. Next is another Lemieux. This one is chocolate brown. I did buy this used, however, it's a medium and I'm not sure that it's gonna fit. So I really have not used it yet, which I should try because if it doesn't fit, I need to sell it. The next is another Lemieux. This is the caramel and this is the close contact shape. I actually really like this pad. It's just the basic suede, but it has the cotton. I think that's an older design. I got it on mega clearance. Next is another half pad. This is a Mattis uh, size large and it's in the all purpose. And so this one I was using on Lucky because he needs some lift in behind with my jump saddle. And so these are great. They have some nice spine free. So these two are just your basic like Roma Wikisy. These are okay. I don't really use them that much. These would be on the chopping block, but I don't think I'd make enough money selling them, so i just keep them anyway. Next, I've got this thin line half pad. This is the cotton one, uh, also size large. Eco Gold Cool Fit. This one is black. And then an Eco Gold Secure. These are my second favorite compared to the Cool Fit. Another Weather Beta pad. This one is okay. But the biggest flaw, in my opinion, is that this doesn't have any sort of curve for the wither. That's the biggest flaw, otherwise I really like it. So in here I've got another Back on Track Knights collection. I haven't taken out the package, clearly. This one is another Eco Gold Cool Fit in the cross country shape. I've got an Eco Gold Secure. This one's a large, it's kind of large. Too big for my saddle, but these are hard to find. So um, this is the Secure in the XL Navy navy even though it looks like royal blue this is going to be really hard oh. okay so here is the ps of sweden um ice blue I'll show you the side of the logo ice blue i don't use this very much i find that my horse sweats a lot in it so next is a lemieux uh benetton blue benetton blue however you say that 
This is just your basic smart pack pad. I keep this one because it's got Lucky's name on it. Here is an Ogilvy dressage Euro cut pad. Uh, I like this one because sometimes it's hot, it's nice and thin. These are my absolute favorite basic pad. Absolute favorite basic pad. So I've got two of these. I have one that's covered up with a bunch of stuff. So it's the navy with white trim. So it's literally the same. But this one is black. And then I've got another Ogilvy Euro cut. Put the other side of the emblem. Euro cut. This one is navy, teal, and white. And here is another one of those weather beater pads that I actually really like. This one I haven't used as much, clearly you can tell. So I've got like the all-purpose ones. I think that last one was like all dressage. This one is an Ogilvy. This is like the all-purpose. I don't think this one. Yeah, this one doesn't have an emblem. It's just like a basic. Then I have the Smart Pack one, and this one has Lucky's name on it and our colors. Here's another Smart Pack one. I won this one at a competition a while ago. I should probably either use it or not. So this is another Ogilvy. I ordered this one custom, and so this is the like cross country shape Ogilvy profile pad and the only thing I don't like about it is it doesn't fit with my saddle because it has like these certain billets that don't separate so I really have not used this much next is the Lemieux CC and this one I think is Peacock I can't remember. So then I've got two more of the Lemieux CC I actually really like these these are both all the suede so this one is just plain white and then a navy. I haven't used this one yet, obviously. Professional's Choice Cross Country Shape. I actually really like this one. It fits my saddle super well. I've got a Cross Country Shape Eagle Gold Cool Fit in navy. And then a Secure Eagle Gold in navy. Okay, last but not least, the, this is another Mattis. This is, it's got a rear roll, I guess they call it. It's a medium jump one. And then... This is a smart pack pad. I literally bought this on clearance for $8 so that I could cut holes in it for my exercise bands. Okay, and then up here is my Cavalieri pad. I actually love this pad. I've done another video on it, so make sure to check that one out. All right guys, so I do ridiculously have other saddle pads that are not out here where I tack up. They're in the house, so we'll have to continue this quest. So I just wanna quickly show you the Last few saddle pads that I have. This is just a brown cotton Lemieux and it's the CC shape. It does not have the super soft under, it's just regular cotton. Eco Gold Cool Fit, Eco Gold Secure Dressage. I guess I have another Eco Gold Cool Fit Dressage. And then an Eco Gold Cool Fit Cross Country. And then a Cross Country. Or no, this one is not. This one is AP. And then secure. Alright guys, I hope you liked that video. Uh, be sure to comment, like, and subscribe to see more videos from me. Bye!